Oh, okay. Let's see what we can find in here. This looks maybe like it was a forge. That's a blacksmith's apron, I'm guessing. I don't know. Berengar's notes. Handwriting looks familiar. Berengar's. Papers have been lying here for years. Damn hunk of metal. A week sweating with bellows and forge, and what do you know? There's Torharn, shining in my hands. And then there it goes, cracking into shards with the first practice strike. Must have botched something in the alloy composition, or cooled it too fast after forging. Hard to say. Just gotta try again, I guess, but not here, because Vesemir's already badgering me with his blasted words of wisdom. Should have known asking his advice was opening up a bottomless can of worms. Don't know how Geralt puts up with that without going the rest of the way crazy. Thanks, Berengar. How about that? He was working on a sword. And not just any sword, judging by his notes. Torhan. Ought to talk to Vesemir. Berengar consulted him. Vesemir might remember how far he got. Yep. Let's see if we can find Vesemir. Ooh. All right. He should be just inside here. I'm back, Vesemir. I've made no story progress. Oh, he's right here. Hello. Yes? What is it, Wolf? Found some of Berengar's notes. From what I made out, he was trying to forge a sword. Torhan, you were helping him. Advising, at best. Boy never managed to forge the blade, but would never let me at the end. Just pestered me with questions. Wanted to do it all by himself, as always. But then the whole plan went to the devil, literally. What do you mean? Berengar set out to hunt a chort. The fiend had made its lair in the valley past the keep. Don't know why, but he took all his equipment with him. Maybe he thought I'd tinker with his sword while he was gone. You know what he was like. At any rate, the chort turned out to be strong. Too strong. Berengar had to turn tail. And since it's hard to run with four stones of kit under your arm, he dropped it all. Came back red with blood. And shame. Hardly said a word. And left soon after. Never to return. Aww. I know the rest of the story. How do I get to this chort's lair? <laughs> I knew you'd want to finish this. Easiest way is to take the river downstream, as far as you can go. But be careful. Berengar had his flaws, but he was a damn good fighter. If that chort's still there, you could be in for a wild ride. Thanks, Vesemir. Don't you worry. Oh. Let's see. Where can we fast travel to? Alright, so we need to go down the river. No boats this time. And there's an upgrade diagram there, too. Roach! There you are. Faster. Have you been enjoying these field trips, Roach? Yeah. Alright, I think this is the river that we need to follow. Let's see how far Roach can take us. Ooh. Go, Roach, go. Oh, not bad so far. That's a lot of trees. Damn, you're up Oh, no! A bear. Come on, Roach. Oh, you got it. You got it. Good job. Oh, Roach. Okay. Most of the way there. Wow. Uh-oh. Run, Roach. Whoa. Oh, okay. That's, that's the end of Roach. <laughs> Maybe they won't notice me down here. 
I don't know. Oh! Escaped their notice. And we got most of the way there. Pretty good. Thank you, Roach. Oh, I wonder where this goes. It probably goes to the edge of the map. That's where. That's my guess. Well, let's go in the cave. This looks like a cat situation. And a Quen situation. River disappears here. I've got to be close. Yep. Oh no, not the skittering. Wait, let's let's look up chorts. Uh, is that here? No. Uh, here? I think it's kind of like a fiend. Samum, puffball. Hopefully that'll also work. Hmm. What's this? That's grape shot. Okay. Damn them. All right. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. What happened to the music? Maybe they just wanted to make it more spooky. Oh. Yeah. Well, we're, we'll Whoa. get our. An old strong bow. No wonder Berengar got in trouble. All right, it's time to re-up your Quen, Geralt. Let's do it. Uh, got him. He didn't seem to care, but... I'm too strong. Yeah, oh, look at this chort. Nothing, come on. So much for the chort. Yeah. Now to find Berengar's things. He didn't even really fight back, which is a shame. Let's see what we can find. Oh, this looks promising. Ah, the diagram. Forging the Torhairn won't be easy, but it's sure as hell worth a try. Okay. All right, I think we're now at the point where we should find a blacksmith and an armorer. Oh. And I think for that, we're going to have to leave Karamoran. Yep. What am I doing? White honey. What is this? Oh, that's fine. So... <gasps> oh, I never got the upgrade diagram. How is that possible? I'm glad I checked my map. Oh, it's under the waterfall. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, all right. Right after I took the cat off, too. You know, maybe it's back here? No. That's the court. Oh, oh, I think it is. I think I see a box. Aha! Good. I'll tell you. I'll tell you where the loop's at. <laughs> oh, you wanna? Geralt, I need to move. You this to is a terrible by? place. What can I do for you? Need some armor made. Witcher's armor. All 
All right, let's see. Wool then. Wanna go up to enhanced? Sure. Since we're here. Might as well, oh no. No, I'm not gonna do superior yet. Yeah, this is several levels below the ursine that I'm wearing right now, so I'm not going to put this on, but I do want to see what it looks like. Okay, Wolven. Look at this, I'm kind of running out of powdered monster tissue. Astonishing. Hmm. Ooh, nice. And was Torheron silver or it's silver? That's too bad. There's no point in me making it then. That this is the wrong craftsperson anyway, but even so. Thank you. Take care now. We want to check it out. Ah, oh, yeah. Pretty sweet. I do think that this is one of the cooler looking armors uh, of the Witcher armors. However, I'm gonna. Switch back to the to the bear for now, because I think it is in fact better. Alrighty. Since we have done Joanna's quest, I think maybe now we should run to Novograd and do the other master artisan quest. So that we can have them both unlocked. Might be time to pay Hattori a visit. What is this sword that I have? Quest Dog. It's pretty cool looking. Anyway. Hello. I've heard that you are an excellent blacksmith, sir. What do you have on offer? Redanian dumplings, speciality of the house, heartily recommended. Blimey. A vat gun in my establishment? It can't be. How do you know I'm a witcher? Are you joking? Silver blades. Who else uses them? Crafted in Mahakam, am I right? Must be about 40 inches long. An elven sword expert. You must be Ibir Hattori. Ah, indeed. I am. Geralt of Rivia. Heard a lot of good things about you. A pleasure, Geralt. How might I help you? Care to try a dumpling? Sure. Thanks. This is a very serious dumpling trial. Mmm. Tasty. <laughs> mm, glad to hear it. Anything else I can do for you? No apple. Looking for a good swordsmith. No one. <laughs> Three swords on your back. A bit much, don't you think? Good one. But all jests aside, you make swords anymore? Really? It's dumplings now. I must make a living. But I miss the hammer, anvil, and bellows. Oh, the heat of the forge. Were it not for that swiving Van Horn. Hmm. Don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I shan't greet a witcher with dumplings. Come, let me show you something. Aha, uh -huh, your secret stash. Quite a collection. Premium quality, too. Thank you. I've kept these as mementos. Damn shame you don't make them anymore. I'd gladly replace what I have with this kind of steel. Someone with your skills? Why the hell are you needing dough? This might surprise you. The pay is better. But above all, it's much safer. 
Food vendors rarely disappear or end up as cripples. I see. Someone controlling Novigrad smithing market? Not officially, though... All supplies go through Ernst Van Horn, and they say he plays cards with Cleaver, frequently. Um, who is that? Ernst Van Horn. Who's that? Modest beginnings. A small dockside workshop. However, he proved extremely ambitious. He knew he could not compete with other sword makers on skill alone, so he resorted to other methods. Other methods? A bit of slander here, buying business debt cheaply and taking over there. And whenever the competition was a plowing non-human, he'd accuse them of being Havocars. Is that how what he did that? you win? I did not give up without a fight. I went to Town Hall, negotiated. Alas, it was all in vain. He'd already enlisted Cleaver's protection. And in Novigrad, few dare get in Cleaver's way. <sighs> Sounds like you're not a very good negotiator. Tried negotiating? Making a deal? With Van Horn? Do you jest? He's a proper heartless bastard. Either play by his rules and pay him, or go out of business. Hmm, I see. But I shan't complain. Dumplings have proven an excellent source of income. It's just... well... You miss the heat of the forge. Tried getting supplies from someone else? Those rogues of the underworld control all the sources. How am I to talk to them? Unless... Would you be willing to help me? Uh... To unlock a master swordsmith? I, I think so. Want me to help you get your supplies? How? Just come with me to a meeting. As my bodyguard, it'll bolster my confidence. Truth be told, not so long ago, I tried negotiating some iron deliveries with one of the King of Beggars' men. Right. King wouldn't worry about an embargo Cleaver imposed. It's just... He demanded an inordinately large share of the profits. I thought you might help me negotiate. I don't mean gratis. I'm certain we can agree on a fee. Could I... choose something from your collection? Oh, forget this rubbish. <laughs> I shall forge you a sword fit for killing gods. I don't right. know. Criminal underworld. Not really sure I want to meddle oh, with Oh, come him. on, Geralt. I badly need your help. Van Horn is a Van Horsen. Good one. He must be taught a lesson. I'd be eternally grateful. Plate armor, yours. Or perhaps you'd like a catapult or a, a trebuchet. I don't know about the last two. Fine. Arrange the meeting. Splendid. Meet me after dark, near the crane at the docks. All right, we can do that. You don't see that kind of behavior in Galaga. Not so much, anyway. All right. Ah. I do kind of miss this. The Novigrad port. Oh. I also just generally miss seagulls. Haven't heard one in a while. Okay, let's meditate until nighttime. Mmm, ten? Oh. All right, Hattori. Let's do some shady business. Fuck. Hey, why you? Hattori? Maybe Oh, there he is. Wow. What timing? This the place. Greetings, Witcher. It's nearby. Ready? Let's do it. Lead the way. Splendid. Come. Alright. Okay. We are going. 
The king of beggars, man. His name is Tinboy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to hire, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. Okay. Oh, are we going in or what? Yes. You were to come alone, elf. Who's this? Back up. Concerned friend. Uh, fine. Here's how we see things. The boss at Loggerheads with Cleaver, there's got to be a payoff. We've got an offer, and it's non-negotiable. Surprise us. A steady supply of iron in exchange for 50% of your profits. 50%? Give you 25. Who are you to dictate anything to the king of beggars? Ugh, 35's as low as we'll go. Alright. That seems fine. 50 sounded ridiculous, but 35, whatever. Fine. We'll take your offer. But perhaps we should... You should go home, elf. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. Uh -oh. oh, tin boy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. What an insult. Damn it. Who's this now? Oh boy. Cleaver's boys. Use devil stars. What do you do? Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, what a dodge. All right. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, I don't think so. Yeah, get him. Whoop. Geralt, quickly. All right. Come on, Hattori. Well, where are you going? Are we going this way? Yeah. How'd that dwarf get over there? Quick! Shut the gate! There could be more of them! Alright. Careful! There could be more in there! In here? We'll have a quen. Follow me. Come on. You coming or what? Now he's coming. Right. Sure hope there's a payoff for the end of this. So, supplies. That's something we can count on? Who'd you take me for? Gave you me word, didn't I? But I'd hire guards if I was you. You never know with Cleaver. Uh. Can you provide protection? A few of Cleaver's little shits escaped. Bugger probably already knows everything. I've no men to spare, can't guarantee your safety. If I was you, I'd lay low for a time. Hmm. Thanks, Tin Boy. Yeah, Down way to the go. Line, the bosses will make a deal. You'll be left alone. All you gotta do is stay alive till then. <laughs> what now? Here we chat while your partner's just flown the coop. Yeah, way to go. You scared hey, off wait. my client. <laughs> Good luck. Not helpful, Tim Boy. Hattori, wait. Where? Watch it, Tran. No sweat, not your We were just ground. talking nicely, sir. Alright, let's go. Hattori! I'm pretty sure I have better stamina than you, Hattori. Boy, Novograd at night. Hattori! Hattori! 
Tori. You in there? Open up. No chance. Leave me be. Don't be silly. Let me in. No, never. I shall stay in here until Middenvern. Middenvern? We don't have until then. Forgive me, Geralt. That was a mistake. To parley with bandits. Make deals. Too late now. King of Beggars will get you supplies and then what? You'll have to pay him. What have I done? Geralt, you must help me! No, I won't. I'm a witcher, not a bodyguard. Can't be tied down. Precisely! You must find me a bodyguard! Geralt, I beg you! They'll kill me! Ah. Uh... What? Where am I supposed to find you a bodyguard? There's a mercenary, Sucrus, often drinks at the Sturgeon. He's an old pirate, a Skelliger. He used to work for me. Huge as an oak, wouldn't fear a dozen cleavers. Can't you talk to him yourself? We parted... not on the best of terms. That is to say, he demanded a bonus and I... Didn't pay him. Great. What now? Am I supposed to pay your dues? I'm certain you'll find some way to agree. Geralt, please don't leave me this way. Ah, oh, fine. I want your swords. All right, Sucris from Skellige. Hard times we were just in the... Skellige. Hopefully we'll be able to make friends. Look at this market at night time. Abandoned. There's meats just lying around. Aha. Uh oh. I think we know which one is ours. What the fuck are you doing? We weren't done conversing. Ah. Call that a conversation? Not your plowing business. You need a smack, is that it? Oh! Wasn't quite ready for that. Woo! Come on. Ah. Uh. Get him, Geralt. No. There we go. Sorry, but you asked for it. I'm Geralt. Sucrus. You did well, mate. An ale to patch things. Come, we'll talk inside. All right, we're friends now. What brings you here, Garrett? What was that fight about? You and the merchant. What was that about? Uh, why Miss Sess wetted that plow and rotter is beyond oh. me. Oh. That was your brother-in-law? Prick-in-law, more like. Uh. Sweet talk made first. Skellige made. We need barrels. We'll be rich, man. So, I brought it in. Then he starts going on about unforeseen storage costs, net gross balances, I don't know what else. Business and family just don't mix. Exactly, mate. <laughs> well, Looking for a bodyguard. Interested? Speaking of business. Why not? If there's coin in it. Well, there isn't. Not yet. Oh, come on, Geralt. Sorry you can do better than that. Favor for a favor, huh? Ugh. Yeah, I guess. What did you have in mind? Brother-in-law owes me some coin. Get it back and we'll talk. <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Damn it. I'll do it. Where'll I find him? Nearby at the docks. You know what? I don't care for his coin all in all. If you don't get it back, I won't mind. So what do you want me to do? Smash his stock of mead. It was me brought it in from Aunt Skelly. That a mature thing to do? <laughs> Nay, but it's fair. 
I can get on board with that. Uh oh. I see some bogeys outside. Uh oh. Watch out. Oh! You know what? I'm tired of nighttime. <laughs> Morning can't come soon enough. Oh, now it's raining. Why do you always do this to me, game? Uh, what are you guys looking at over here? With your little spyglass. Looking at those boats? Aww. Okay. It must be this boat over here. Damn. Run, girl. Jump. Whee. Okay. Where's the brother? Oh, I can just destroy his goods. That works for me. Let's save first, though, just in case it goes sideways. Maybe, maybe Ard. Yes. Bandits. That's right, get out of here. That's what I thought. He's gone mad! Run! There you go, solved your problem. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my gosh, Geralt. 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 All I want is this box, and there's nothing in it. You know that. Oh, there, nothing good. Well, anyway, we wrecked all of it. Problem solved. Excellent. It's raining again. I know. It's raining again. Watch out, henchmen. Thank you. Ramen supper, I never refuse. Alright, Sucrus. Job done. Greetings. Hi, hi, Garrett. How you doing? Got rid of that shipment. Is that so? Well done, mate. So who am I to knock off? No, no. Not Just that kind of job. Keep an eye on someone. This swordsmith. Seems you know each other. I be your Hattori, the elf. Tried swindling me on axes once, the bastard. You working for him? You could say that. We're trying to dismantle the swordsmithing monopoly in Novigrad. <laughs> oh, noble cause. Mm -hmm. Well, you're vouching for him. Don't see why not. I'll grab some of the boys and we can go. All right. Pleasure doing business. Come on, boys. Let's go. Hi, B. Thanks, I guess. Okay, guys. That's enough. Come on, Sucrus. Faster. I'll beat you there. All right, Hattori. Can I have my swords now? That's all I want. Whoa, what, what are you doing, Bard? Watch out. Is it on this side or is it... Oh, yeah, okay, we're good. Uh, Hattori? Yeah, he's over here. Now, look, they beat me here somehow. Very fast pirates. Wouldn't mind a donut. Me neither. 
All right, Hattori, come on. Greetings, Hattori. See, Sucrus already found you. You two agree to something? Yes, Geralt. I was forced to sell him a few axes at the wholesale price, but I was glad to do it. Thank you. You're welcome. Finally accepting orders for swords again? Sadly, no. <sighs> I lack certain crafting supplies. Let me guess. Ernst van Horn's got a monopoly on them as well. Just so. He bought them cheap from sword makers abandoning the trade. Now he hoards them like a squirrel. But if you... No, you'd never agree. We've come this and far. Know what? I happen to know where Van Horn keeps his hoard. It's more than he could possibly ever use. We could borrow a little. Uh-huh. What are you getting me into? Borrow? Don't you mean steal? Stealing from a thief's no crime. It isn't? So what is it? Poetic justice? How did I get sucked into this? And why? It's simple. The best swords you've ever seen. Armor, trebuchet, catapults. He's all right. right. All right, Assuming I agree, how do you see this? Van Horn has his warehouse at the docks. The materials I need are very heavy. You must ask Sucrus to take his boys. Uh, one more thing. The crates I need will smell of ammonia. All right. Fine, Hattori. This better be the last thing. Gather Sucrus and his boys. Come on, boys. Oop. Greetings. Oh, Geralt. How are things? Hattori's got a job for us. Great. I was starting what to get bored. What is going on Wants with your eyes? I borrow a few crates from Ernst Van Horn's warehouse. They'll smell of ammonia. Mm, sounds doable. I know where Van Horn stores his goods. The boys and I will go there, look around. Meet us near the sturgeon. Okay. Fine. When? After dark, of course. See you there. Of course. All right, Sucrus. Boys. See you there. It's 8.30 in the morning, sir. 